Hello and good morning, good afternoon, and um, whatever time you're watching this, hello. So, um, I hope you're all okay. Um, Easter break is finally over, um, so it's back to learning. Um, I hope you're all okay. I hope you, you and your families are safe and doing well and trying to keep occupied as much as you can. Um, I've been spending most of my time um, over Easter occupying my time with playing games. I love to play a game um, just past the time. It's a bit of fun. So I have played over this half term. I have played cards about a hundred times. I have played Bananagrams, which is a word game, about a hundred times. I've played Uno probably a thousand times. I've played Tiddlywinks, classic old game. I've played Dice. I've played Rocket Ship Kaplunks. I've done about three or four puzzles and now I'm getting a little bit bored um, so I thought this is a good opportunity to um, speak to you guys and get your ideas on what to do next so I've had an idea I have created a grid it's about a hundred squares in this and I thought I'd make my own board game so my challenge to you is can you design me a board game? Um, as I said, I've got dice, I've got um, little pieces, I've got all these different things that I could go and use to make my board game. But unfortunately, my brain is not working and I can't think of a single idea. So you guys are creative, so I thought I would ask you. So here's your challenge. My sizzling challenge. So our learning intention is to provide some instructions. So our sizzling challenge is, did I think of a game that I could play? Did I say what equipment I need? And did I explain how to play the game? For a hot challenge, if you fancy something a little bit trickier, is, did I explain why I chose this game? Did I explain what equipment I need and why? And did I write instructions of how to play the game? Because I'm going to need instructions because I can't think. And Scorching is, did I explain why I chose this game? A little bit to mix it up. Did I think of a new rule I could add? And finally, did I write an ordered and clear instructions? And if you really fancy a challenge, my red hot challenge. Can you create your own game? Something brand new. Don't forget to include instructions and rules. If you could help me out, I would appreciate it so much. Passing the time is getting slowly harder. And um, I think if we work together, we can create something wonderful. So, a little bit about how to write instructions. Nice and simple. So, this is my advice on how to write clear instructions. You need to really think about it. What I would do at the top of the paper is I would write what game it is. Because I can't think of one, I'm just going to put Mr. Rook. Mr. Rook's game. And I would start off by putting numbers down the side. So I know what order to go and do them in. So number one, I would set out the board. Number two, I would put my counters at the start. Number three, what can I write for number three? Um, so if I've got a board, I've got my counters at the start. Hmm. This is why I need your help. I can't think. So, if you can help me out, I would appreciate it so much. Um, I will leave the learning intentions um, and the success criteria for each one in the description of this video. So hopefully you will be able to create something wonderful. Um, if you can email them to your teachers or email them to me, I would appreciate it. 
Um, if you email them to your teachers, they will send them to me and I will have a go and see how they work. I'm very interested to go and see what you guys have come up with. Um, so please let me know and I hope you'll stay safe and I'll see you all soon. See you later.